सो एक करंट आई फ्लोज अलॉन्ग ए राउंड लूप फाइंड द इंटीग्रल पी डॉट डी आर अलॉन्ग द एक्सेस ऑफ द लूप फ्रॉम माइनस इन्फिनिटी टू प्लस इन्फिनिटी सो दिस इज आवर लूप एंड दिस इज द एक्सेस एट ए जनरल पॉइंट एक्स इफ यू टेक ए स्मॉल एलिमेंट डी एक्स देन वी नीड टू फाइंड बी एक्स डॉट डी एक्स एंड देन वी नीड टू इंटीग्रेट इट फॉर द होल एक्सेस so for a current carrying circular loop at a distance x we know that the field is this it's a formula so we are going to use this formula so this times dx and limits from minus infinity to plus infinity to solve this integral we use the substitution x is equal to r tan theta so dx becomes r sec square theta d theta so you put the value of dx here and put the value of x here and what you will get is mu not i by 2 cos theta d theta now when dx when x is minus infinity theta is minus pi by 2 and when x is plus infinity the x is plus infinity then theta is plus pi by 2 so limits will be minus pi by 2 to plus pi by 2 so integral of cos theta d theta which is sin theta plus pi by 3 to minus pi by 2 it is 2 so mu not i by 2 into 2 which is mu not i which is our answer now explain the result obtained what he means is see the same result can be obtained by ampere's law by considering a large loop so this this line is extending to infinity and minus infinity so let's extend this into a rectangular loop and all these distances a d c and b are at infinity so at all these points and all this three parts of this rectangle b is zero so if you go inside the loop for the ampere's law b dot dl is equal to mu not times i enclosed so the current cutting through this area is only i which is cutting here so integral line integral b dot dl is equal to mu not i in which becomes mu not i and this line integral for only ab will have some value for bc cd da it will be zero because b is zero so we could have obtained the same result using ampere's law without the calculation